Am I the scumbag for getting my aunt and uncle kicked out of their house for not letting my husband and I sleep together? I, male 27, am married to a man, male 28. He's the love of my life. I only ever dated women before him, but when I met him, I realized I was bi, and we fell in love. We got married in the fall of 2018, so it's been almost four years. We now live in Vermont. My whole family is from a small town in Texas, a super conservative Catholic area. I was raised there, but dad got a job in New York City when I was 15. The culture shock was different. We went from living in rural Texas to living in an apartment in Manhattan. My parents didn't sell our house in Texas. They allowed our aunt and uncle, who just had their third child, to move in while charging them a small rent. In college, when I came out as bi, my brother and dad were very supportive. My mom needed some time to accept. The rest of my family reacted poorly at first, but came around. During visits, we stayed with my aunt and uncle at my old house, but because we weren't married, we weren't allowed to share a bed. We didn't argue. We both would rather make peace. Visiting since, instead of staying with my aunt and uncle, we would rent a motel room. During COVID, we did not visit them. But this summer, my parents and bro decided to visit my hometown again for two weeks and invited my husband and I. I wanted a motel again, but my aunt and uncle insisted my brother, husband, and I stay with them. The first night sleeping situation was being discussed after my cousins went to bed. My aunt and uncle wanted me and bro to take the spare bedroom, husband on the couch. All three of us took issue with that. They snapped that we were not really married because we were gay and they had children in the house. They said it would be a bad influence on their kids. This hurt my husband's feelings and he started crying and ran out of the room. When my husband ran out, my uncle had the audacity to start laughing. That's when I saw red. I started cussing them out so loudly that my young cousins came to investigate. I told them that if they didn't go apologize to my husband immediately, then I was going to tell my dad what just happened, and I was going to make sure to have them kicked out of the house that was still in my parents' name. My brother seconded everything I was saying. They started backtracking and saying that we were still welcome in their house, but we had to follow their rules. I responded that it wasn't really their house. I told them they were going to be homeless if I had my way. The kids started crying because they heard me say they were all going to be homeless. So we left. My husband was on the porch crying. I promised him I would never subject him to that again. I told dad what happened. To say that my dad was angry would be an understatement. He served them a notice of eviction for 60 days. I have been getting calls and texts and Facebook messages from my family, calling me a scumbag. I want to know if I'm the scumbag for allowing my young cousins to end up homeless. Is it fair they have to pay for what my aunt and uncle said to me and my husband?